On October 28, 2024, Dana brought record-breaking rainfall of southeast Spain with area like Chiva experienced nearly a year worth in a single night. Torrential rain triggered catastrophic flash floods across Valencia, affecting towns such as Chiva and Murica. Tragically, the extreme weather led to the loss of at least 64 lives with thousands more injuries in flooded regions. In Chiva, hundreds of residents were evacuated on October 28th as floodwaters quickly rose, threatening in homes. Emergency services have been heavily involved in rescue operation. To reach in isolated areas remain a challenge due to impossible roads. Flooding severely disrupted transportation in Valencia, damaging roads, railways, and bridges that remained temporarily closed as October of 13. Chivas agriculture sector suffered as floods destroyed crops and farmland and to grow the local farmers and the economy. Local businesses, particularly in Chiva and Valencia, experience closures and now face heavy repair costs. Thousands of homes in flood-affected areas endured water damage, causing residents substantial financial burdens. On October 29, the flooding damaged electrical infrastructure, resulting in blackout that left parts of Valencia and Chiva without power. <laughs> Telecommunications were disrupted in flooded areas, making communication for rescue coordination difficult. Flood waters contaminated drinking water supplies, posing health risks in Chiva and surrounding town. <laughs> Intense water flow led to soil erosion, damaging the natural landscape and destabilizing local ecosystems. Popular tourist destinations in Valencia were closed, leading the cancellations that impacted the tourism economy.
Pero más que estoy aquí enganchado. Wildlife was displaced from damaged inhabitants due to rising water level across rural areas. Authorities launched large-scale rescue operation on October 29, deploying boats and helicopters to evacuate residents in need. The government issued safety warnings, advising residents in Chiva and nearby areas to stay indoors and go These severe done events have renewed discussion in Spain on the importance of climate resilience and preparedness for further extreme weather events.